Hi guys, welcome to my quickie kitchen and in today's video I'm going to share a recipe of an easy breezy cheesecake because simply it's so easy to make. So whenever you don't feel like touching your oven and you know have a cake instead just by assembling things out so this is the perfect recipe to be in here. So without wasting time let's check the ingredients. So I have my round cake tin ready lined with butter paper. Then we have 200 grams cream cheese, strawberry jelly mix. 200 grams uh, fresh cream, 2 spoons of yogurt, water, 1 cup, then half a cup sugar, vanilla essence, 150 grams digestive biscuits and some butter. So begin by adding the biscuits to a blending jar and we'll blend it for a minute or so. Uh, you know, we just need to have a coarse mixture. So after 1 minute blending, I get this kind of mixture. To this, I'll add my butter to it and you know, combine it well, mix it well. Now we need to transfer it to our cake tin and you know, press it very well uh, using a spoon or some heavy object to make it an even surface. We simply need to pack it in very well, like very well. Cover it with cellophane and freeze it until we prepare cheesecake mix. Okay, so next step, we are going to take our cream cheese in a separate mixing bowl and to this we'll add our powdered sugar and then we have to whisk it together for like, you know, a minute or so till it becomes a smooth mixture. Now comes in the time to add your yogurt into it and you have to whisk it again for like few seconds, 30 seconds, 45 seconds. Next, I'll be adding fresh cream to the mixture and whisk it again for a minute. And once it is done, we'll be adding vanilla essence to it so that it gives out good fragrance. In a pan, I'm going to take half a cup of water and wait till it comes to a boil. So now our water has boiled and I'm just going to switch off the flame and put it on rest for like few seconds so that it cools off a bit. To this, now I'll add a half of my jelly mixture and rest half I'll be using for topping. Okay, so just you have to wait for 10 odd minutes. Now we need to transfer the jelly mixture we prepared into our cream cheese mixture and we just have to, you know, whisk it for a minute or so. Uh, this basically helps the cream cheese mixture to bind, you know. It, uh, it helps us to stay firm. Now you have to pour in the cheesecake mixture to your cake tin and following which you have to refrigerate your cheesecake for at least, at least 4 hours. So now let's start with the topping. So you have to prepare jelly again. In the same way you have to boil water, you have to put in jelly mixture and wait till 10 minutes. Okay, so now I'm going to top it with some freshly chopped fruits. I'm using hair plums and uh, once it is done, see I've just decorated it this way and now I'll add my jelly mixture over it. So just remember to do these steps after at least one hour of refrigeration. Okay, and see here my cake is ready. So guys, trust me, it feels so light and tasty. Do try it at your place. Hope you enjoyed my video. Bye-bye.